Hello and welcome. Today I'm going to share with you how to increase traffic using Facebook. So before I begin, there are some references that may be helpful to you. One of them is uh, if you go to facebook.com and look for your trusted source, you'll be able to link to my Facebook page and I hope you will like my page. You can also go to YouTube and look for my username markho at markho8869. There are more videos there and I also hope that you can click on the like and subscribe button. And also you can go to YouTube to look for this particular video. Uh, you'll be and search it and search for this keyword how to increase traffic by boosting Facebook posts. Okay, so now we'll go right into things. Okay, so the first step is basically to create a Facebook page. It's relatively easy. You just need to create, click on the create button here, click on page, and basically follow the process through. Okay, my suggestion is to click on business or brand, then just follow the instruction. It's very easy, just and I'm not going to go in depth because it will take up some time. Now the next thing is to create a, a post. So also quite straightforward. After you have created your page, uh, there is you just need to create a post here and then click post. So I've created several posts already in my page. I'm going to show you one example on how to uh, increase traffic by boosting your post. Okay, I'm going to boost this post. This this article is basically uh, getting. Uh, giving help to parents for, for the, their baby if they are not able to sleep. Okay, so first thing is you click on boost. Here, select uh, send people to your website. There are more options. I will normally choose the first one. There are more options here, but my suggestion is to leave it. If you can, if you want, you can always explore. The next thing is to make sure you select the correct uh, audience. This is important. So you click on edit. Uh, leave the gender or uh, there's no need for you to choose because you don't know uh, which gender would like your post or not. So my suggestion is to leave to select all. Leave the age group uh, by default. If you want to change, you can also. You can uh, target specific countries. So in this case, maybe I just want to target uh, Singapore and the uh, United States. Just select this. Okay, and here they will tell you that basically uh, your audience is still very broad. Now there is a very powerful tool which Facebook has. You can actually target with people with specific interests. My article is about about sleep, right? Getting helping baby to or children to sleep. So my interest uh, logically will be sleep. So I, I will choose sleep as the interest. Okay, you can see that still fairly broad. Most of the time is fine. You can leave it fairly broad and you can continue. Uh, the the thing is you can always add additional interest. My suggestion is not to add too many interests because if not, then you will not know whether this particular interest you are targeting is the correct interest, and it, it makes it difficult for you to change later on. So my suggestion is to leave it to one interest. So then after that, you can click. You can actually click save. You click save. So that uh, that that will do for the target audience. So uh, again, so it is fairly broad. So in this case, what I can do is I can actually change the age group. Okay, as you can see, if I once I change the age group, right, they will say that my target audience is uh, defined. Good job. So what they are trying to tell you is uh, by doing this, right, your your target audience uh, is easier for Facebook to reach out to the correct target audience. Okay, so I save this. Uh, there are other options. You can explore it later. So this is the point that is important. You must make sure you set your budget correctly, or else you'll be paying for the you'll be paying for a lot which you are not aware of, or you accidentally click the numbers wrongly. So first, select the duration. My suggestion to is to select at least three days and above to see the results. So in this case, I put as five days, and I put the total budget as ten dollars, which means to say one day I'm spending two dollars. Uh, they will tell you with this budget potentially you can reach out. Uh, a range of 210 to 600, uh, sorry, 210 to 610 people. Of course, if you increase the budget, you reach out to more people. Now, with that, uh, you just need to click on boost post and the post uh, will be boosted. Okay, in this case, I'm not going to uh, boost this post. Now, you can also boost other posts, uh, any pictures, any videos. The, the process is the same. However, there will be times where you may encounter this issue, which I'm going to show you right now. When you click on boost post, 
they will tell you that your it your app may not run because uh, this particular portion or your text that's written here uh, they don't really allow so it's okay what you can do is you can still click and proceed the same and you submit if it's really being rejected then you may want to see uh, the wordings here you may need to change the text uh, so that you no know, they will approve okay but most of the time if you click uh, request manual review, uh, they should approve. But in, in the event they do not, you just need to amend your advertisement accordingly. So that's done. You have already uh, post your advertisement and you are waiting for the ad to run. So once the ad is running, they will actually inform you that your ad is running. The next thing is to make sure you check the results. Uh, my suggestion is to do it three days later. Of course, you can check it every day if you want to. Okay, this is the uh, summary of the advertisement I've post so far. Uh, and you can actually see all the advertisement if you want to skip all. Now it's important to check the stats because you want the statistics because you want to make sure whatever you're doing is correct. So in this particular example, I'm going to show you this. Uh, my objective is to make sure or to get the people who see this advertisement to click to the link to see my, my YouTube video. Of course, you can boost product, you can boost uh, a page or an article once you created the post. So this is the result. So basically what they're telling me is I reached out to 3,022 people and 136 people have clicked uh, on this advertisement. And these are the gender, the people, the women that's reaching out. So I'm, I'm quite happy that this thing is working. And uh, if you realize for this particular age group, uh, it's not doing so well. That's the reason why I increased the age group to 24. And uh, and they will also tell you the, the total budget you have spent so far. Okay. And uh, what is the cost to reach out to one person to click is about 24 cents. Okay. So all the data are here. Um, and if you think it's not working, you can stop it three days later or even stop it anytime, even the first day if you want. So that's the advantage of this. And if it's working well, you may even want to increase the budget to reach out to more people. So you can monitor this uh, very closely. And so to go back to what we have touched on, the sixth step, creating a post. So I create a page first, then you create a post, then you boost the post, you set the target audience and the budget and you review the performance. So we've already done uh, all that already. And uh, a reminder of the reference, you can go to YouTube to look for this particular video. So if you go to YouTube, uh, this, is, this, are, this is my channel. You can see there are a lot of videos that will be helpful for you. Uh, my, this particular video has not been uploaded yet, but I'm very sure once I upload this, it will be uh, shown in the first page in, in YouTube. And this is the my Facebook page, and uh, do remember to uh, review and then click on like, and do remember to leave any comment you might have in the link below. And if you're using other video source to look at my video, uh, you can send an email to me directly. So with this, I'd like to end the presentation, and I hope you have enjoyed uh, and get, get some value from this. And thank you very much. Have a great day. Goodbye.